a group known as Health of Mother Earth Foundation, HOMIF, is calling for the total eradication of genetically modified beans because of its harmful components to human health. The group said this in Abuja as part of its sensitization program on the health hazards associated with genetically modified organisms, which seem to be an acceptable mode of farming in most parts of the world. Emmanuel Higini completes the report. The executive director of Health of Mother Health Foundation, Nimo Basi, has called for a moratorium on genetically modified beans due to its health and other socioeconomic implications. Basi has also taxed the National Assembly on the need to come up with a legislation that will regulate the importation of GMOs into the country by greedy and fraudulent donors. Why this is so critical is the fact that Nigeria is the center of origin of beans. And when you genetically engineer a crop in its center of origin, it means you are completely overturning what nature has done, completely. Because when it's gone in the center of origin, unless some seeds are saved in the seed bank in Norway, which is buried underground in Norway, unless, unless you go there to, to, to buy some seeds to replace the one you've lost, it's lost forever. Other experts pointed out the danger for Nigeria if it allows itself to be used by these Shylock businessmen to infiltrate and destroy Nigeria's ecosystem and the sub-region. They also gave a scientific analysis of how the intended aim of better incidents for agricultural purposes can have counterproductive implications on the health of humans. Before you plant out their beans, you have to go to them to buy the beans. Because you can, if you don't, you are, it's, well, I mean, I'm a lawyer, I mean, I have my colleague here, TJ, is there, she can tell you, anything they have a patent in it, if you take it, it's, 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 it, you can, it's a criminal suit. They will sue you for it. It's their property, quote and unquote, for something they never created. They were not there when God gave us beans. They've now gone to add some things inside it and say, no, it's their creation and they created it. And so the farmers will go to them. And most of this, we call them a terminator. So you plant them once, you cannot plant them again. The fact that what you spray is able to take out life because you consider it plant means there are unanswered questions about its activity. And therefore, is that the most sustainable means for weed control? That's the question that has not been answered. If I alter the gene of a plant so that when an insect eats it, that insect will die. I hope you know that the whole, the concentration of that pesticide in, in parentheses which I put in that plant goes and comes to my table and it enters my system. I consume them. The general consensus by all the stakeholders present is that GMO is dangerous to health and the ecosystem and should be discouraged by the government. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.